I wanted to make a video of my preparations, so what I normally do for fixing my gloves or what I'm using during the training or the games and stuff like this. So this video is more for goalkeepers, I guess, but even if you, you're not a goalkeeper, you can maybe share the tip to a goalkeeper that you know or any anyone else in your team. So what I normally do is I have, I don't know if you can see it now, yes, a new pair of gloves. I have, take this, oof. So, this is, let's bring it closer, totally new. I don't know if you can see, there's always some stuff when they're new there's like yeah textures and this from from the um, from the box or what do you say so what i normally do is normally i bring it maybe to into the shower the day before when i use them but not this time so I'll do, we do it like this we put some water I think most of you goalkeepers know the new feeling with new gloves. They're very slippery. So now, when we try, yeah, not much of work there. Just put some water on the ball as well and put even more on the gloves so you will have not much of grip here so what I normally do is like this I'll take this off I'll try to clean I'll take off the stuff from the glove and now yeah, there's still leftovers, of course, but I feel like it's it's better. And then we have this one. I think a lot of you guys have heard about it, Vaseline. It her, uh, it sounds strange <laughs> that this should work, but it really makes a big, big difference. Since I started using it I have much more confidence in my grip and uh, yeah for catching the balls everything so especially when it's wet a little bit wet you always need water but normally there's always water on the pitches where we when we play and when we train so um, you can see now there's I don't know if you see it Hard to see, but this the Vaseline brings out a lot of stuff from the glove as well. So I take one more time with a towel to take the stuff away, and now we see I put some more water. We take the ball. I can make it. So you see. you can hear as well that's what I call a good, a good gripper not even used one one time and you feel this so you need it's always good to have water to get like uh, the friction uh, from the ball and with the with the glove and uh, I usually put it on the post, next to the post, uh, and also my sh um, 
my shin pad as well, uh, so I have it close uh, during the game, so I can just take a small, you don't need much, it's just a really really small amount, so I just put it and then it's uh, you're good to go. So um, I hope this video helped you guys, and um, if it did, please comment down below, and uh, I would love to see the reactions and uh, see if it made any difference for you, uh, it made definitely for me, and uh, I hope you um, yeah, can develop even better grip uh, with this kind of help. So uh, make sure to like and subscribe and uh, see you guys in the next one. Ciao! Now we're going to test the new hands. Or are you ready, Johan? Sure. Let's go. Let's go. It looks like it's going to be a nice training. Glemma det. Vad vad är titeln på den här videon då? Okay, let's go well. Go well. Det er godt grebet! Godt, Kalle. Godt, du bliver på fødderne. Ja. Sidste! Godt, Kalle. Godt. Det er vores volley, low, high. Kan I huske det? Ja. Så efter... Det er ikke så langt herude. Det er glad, at det skal komme tidligt. Glad her. Op på benene igen. Høj for mig. Johan, du hjælper mig nu. Ja. Lad os putte en low ball for sten. Jeg vil ikke. Bare holde den ud af nettet. Bare holde den safe. Ja. Ja. Det var kigge heller ikke. Alle bare lige kigge her. Johan, det er... Yes, go Kalle, go!
wait, wait, wait. Okay. Yes. Ah, Bohan Kelle. Siehst du her, Kelle? Komm. Yes. Up, up. Yes. Okay, Kelle. Okay.